Mark Twain, born Samuel Langhorn Clemens on November 30, 1835, in Florida, Missouri, was a prominent American author and humorist. He is best known for his novels The Adventures of Tom Sawyer and Adventures of Huckleberry Finn, which are considered some of the greatest works of American literature. Twain's life was marked by numerous adventures, literary achievements, and social commentary. Twain grew up in Hannibal, Missouri, a town on the banks of the Mississippi River. His childhood experiences in this small town, with its bustling river trade and diverse characters, would later inspire his writing. He had limited formal education and began working as a typesetter and printer's apprentice at a young age, where he developed his interest in writing and storytelling often contributing articles to his older brother Orion Clemens' newspaper. In the late 1850s, Twain worked as a riverboat pilot on the Mississippi River, a period that greatly influenced his later works. The term Mark Twain itself comes from a riverboat term meaning two fathoms deep, which he adopted as his pen name. He briefly served as a Confederate soldier during the Civil War but left the military to pursue a career in journalism and writing. Twain's first successful humorous story, The Celebrated Jumping Frog of Calaveras County, was published in 1865, bringing him national recognition. His travel writing gained popularity, particularly The Innocents Abroad, based on his experiences traveling through Europe and Palestine. This book established his reputation as a keen observer of human nature and a master of satire. His novel The Adventures of Tom Sawyer, written in 1876, draws from Twain's own childhood memories and captures the escapades of a mischievous young boy growing up along the Mississippi River. Adventures of Huckleberry Finn, published in 1884, is regarded as Twain's masterpiece. This novel explores the adventures of Huck Finn and the runaway slave Jim, offering a candid portrayal of the racial and moral issues of the time. Twain's later years were marked by financial difficulties due to investments and business ventures that didn't succeed. He continued writing and lecturing, gaining international acclaim for his wit and social commentary. Twain passed away on April 21, 1910, in Reading, Connecticut, leaving behind a legacy as one of America's most celebrated authors. His works have been translated into numerous languages and remain influential in discussions about race, society, and the American experience. Mark Twain's unique blend of humor, social criticism, and vivid storytelling made him a literary icon whose works continue to be studied and cherished today. Why waste your money looking up your family tree? Just go into politics and your opponent will do it for you. God created war so that Americans would learn geography. No amount of evidence will ever persuade an idiot. A banker is a fellow who lends you his umbrella when the sun is shining, but wants it back the minute it begins to rain. The lack of money is the root of all evil. Don't go around saying the world owes you a living. The world owes you nothing. It was here first. The older I get, the more clearly I remember things that never happened. Politicians and diapers must be changed often and for the same reason. I was educated once, it took me years to get over it. Good decisions come from experience. Experience comes from making bad decisions. Kindness is the language which the deaf can hear and the blind can see. Give every day the chance to become the most beautiful day of your life. If you don't read the newspaper, you're uninformed. If you read the newspaper, you're misinformed. We may not pay Satan reverence, for that would be indiscreet, but we can at least respect his talents. The two most important days in your life are the day you are born and the day you find out why. It's easier to fool people than to convince them that they have been fooled. Worrying is like paying a debt you don't owe. It could probably be shown by facts and figures that there is no distinctly Native American criminal class except Congress. If voting made any difference, they wouldn't let us do it. 
It is by the goodness of God that in our country we have those three unspeakably precious things, freedom of speech, freedom of conscience, and the prudence never to practice either of them. Honesty, the best of all the lost arts. It's easy to make friends, but hard to get rid of them. There is nothing so annoying as having two people talking when you're busy interrupting. Get your facts first, and then you can distort them as much as you please. Some people bring joy wherever they go, and some people bring joy whenever they go. Do not complain about growing old. It is a privilege denied to many. The man who does not read has no advantage over the man who cannot read. I have never let my schooling interfere with my education. A lie can travel halfway around the world while the truth is putting on its shoes. I do not fear death. I had been dead for billions and billions of years before I was born and had not suffered the slightest inconvenience from it. Forgiveness is the fragrance that the violet sheds on the heel that has crushed it. The trouble is not in dying for a friend, but in finding a friend worth dying for. When angry, count four. When very angry, swear. I've had a lot of worries in my life, most of which never happened. Always acknowledge a fault. This will throw those in authority off their guard and give you an opportunity to commit more. The more I learn about people, the more I like my dog. Never argue with a fool, onlookers may not be able to tell the difference. In the first place God made idiots. This was for practice. Then he made school boards. Censorship is telling a man he can't have a steak just because a baby can't chew it. Noise proves nothing. Often a hen who has laid an egg cackles as if she had laid an asteroid. It takes your enemy and your friend, working together, to hurt you to the heart, the one to slander you and the other to get the news to you. Often it does seem such a pity that Noah and his party did not miss the boat. Sanity and happiness are an impossible combination. Religion was invented when the first con man met the first fool. There's one way to find out if a man is honest, ask him, if he says yes, you know he's crooked. It is better to deserve honors and not have them than to have them and not deserve them. There are many humorous things in the world, among them, the white man's notion that he is less savage than the other savages. All you need in this life is ignorance and confidence then success is sure. If animals could speak, the dog would be a blundering outspoken fellow, but the cat would have the rare grace of never saying a word too much. Don't part with your illusions. When they are gone you may still exist, but you have ceased to live. Don't wake up a woman in love. Let her dream so that she does not weep when she returns to her bitter reality. Writing is easy. All you have to do is cross out the wrong words. Travel is fatal to prejudice, bigotry, and narrow-mindedness. The worst loneliness is to not be comfortable with yourself. Everyone is a moon and has a dark side which he never shows to anybody. Never allow someone to be your priority while allowing yourself to be their option. Truth is stranger than fiction. But it is because fiction is obliged to stick to possibilities, truth isn't. Of all the animals, man is the only one that is cruel. He is the only one that inflicts pain for the pleasure of doing it. It is curious that physical courage should be so common in the world and moral courage so rare. There is a charm about the forbidden that makes it unspeakably desirable. My books are water, those of the great geniuses is wine. Everybody drinks water. A half-truth is the most cowardly of lies. What is joy without sorrow? What is success without failure? What is a win without a loss? What is health without illness? 
You have to experience each if you are to appreciate the other. Let us be thankful for the fools, but for them the rest of us could not succeed. Facts are stubborn things, but statistics are pliable.